Hello. In this session, we are going to see one example that is based uh, on quadratic equation that how to find out two digit number uh, using quadratic equation with the given conditions. So, as we know, in two digit number, uh, for example, if we take uh, 54, 54. Now, in this, 5 is in 10th place value and 10th place and uh, 4 is in at unit place. So, 5 will get multiplied by 10 plus the 4 will get multiplied by 1. So, the number form is 5 into 10 that is 50 plus 4 into 1 that is 4. So, it is 54. So, this is how uh, two digit numbers are formed. So, we will take the one example here. Now, given example is a two digit number is four times the sum of its digits. It is also equal to three times the product of its digit and find the number. So first we will take the two digit number and we are going to uh, define its unit place value and tens place value. So we will take that let, let the tens place value, let the tens place digit the x and the units place digit digit b y so if we take tens place as x uh, value uh, digit and units place digit as y so the number will form so original number original number that we are going to get as we have seen that the tens place value is multiplied by 10 and units place digit is multiplied by 1 so the number will form here is 10 into x 10x plus unit place value get multiplied by 1 so it will be y into 1 that is y so the original number as per our assumption like we have taken x as a tens place digit and your uh, y as a unit place digit so the number that we are going to form is 10x plus y. For example, if it would have been here 5 and it's 4, the number form would have been here 5 into 10 plus 4 into 1. So it will be 50 plus so it will be 54. So, so x and y are tens and units. So 10x plus y. Now we we'll take uh, the conditions that are given. A two digit number is four times the sum of its digits so digits are here x and y many of the students uh, take that 10x is a digit no 10x is not a digit that's the value uh, 10 into y that's tens place value but here is tens place digit is x and unit place digit is y so as per the first condition as per the first condition as per the first condition what is given here is the two digit number that we have got that 10x plus y is four times the sum of its digit. So two digit number that is 10x plus y is equals to four times that is multiplied the sum of its digits. So digits are x and y. So x plus y the sum of its digits. As we have taken example of 54, the sum of its digits will be what 5 plus 4, not 5 into 10 plus 4. So the digits are 5 plus 4, that is the sum of digit is x plus y. So the two digit number is 4 times, two digit number is 4 times the sum of its digits. So if you saw this, 10x plus y is equals to 4x plus 4y. So 10x minus 4 x and we shift this y there so 4y minus y so it will be 6x is equals to 3y now as we know we have to solve this by quadratic equation so in quadratic equation we have to use at the final uh, one variable so we'll uh, make one of these variable as a subject here so for example if we make y as a subject so we'll take 3 here so 6x upon 3 equals to y so it will be 2 so 2x equals to y so therefore in the place of y in the coming uh, equations we can put y is equals to 2x now what is the second condition it is also equal to 3 times the product of its 
digit. So that two digit number as per second condition as per second condition is the two digit number that two digit number is 10x plus y is equal to three times three times the product of its digits. So product will be x into y the digits are x and y. So 10x plus y equals to 3x. So now it will be 10x plus y. So in the place of y we can substitute 2x. So 2x is equals to 3x in the place of y we can write this 2x. Huh? We can write here since we know that y is equals to 2x. Now the equation will become here is 12x is equals to 6x squared. It will be 6x squared. Now shift this 12 that side so it will be 0 here. 6x squared minus 12x. That is nothing but equals to 6x squared minus 12x is equals to 0. Now if we take 6x common here, so 6x bracket x minus 2 equals to 0. Now 6x equals to 0 or x minus 2 is equals to 0. So x is equals to 0, 0 divided by 6 here and x is equals to 2. So x is 0 and x equals to 2. So we got x equals to 0 and x equals to 2. So it can be 0 also or it can be 2 also. Now as we have taken the tens place here x. So if the tens place becomes 0 then it becomes a 1 digit number. But it is given that it is a 2 digit number. If you put x equals to 0 here to 10 into 0, 0. So it becomes a 1 digit number. So we cannot take x equals to 0. So therefore x equals to 0 is discarded. Uh, is discarded because if we put x equals to 0 the number will become one digit number but it is given it is a two digit number so we'll take x equals to 2 so x is equals to 2 so the original number original number is equals to 10x plus y so 10 uh, x that is 2 okay okay we have not found uh, uh, y value so we'll first find the uh, y value so here x we got 2 now therefore uh, y is equals to will be 2x that is 2 into 2 that is 4 so y is 4 therefore original number therefore original number is equals to 10x plus y so it is 10 into 2 plus y that is 4 so it will be 20 plus 4 that is 24 the two digit number here we got is 24. So this is how we can solve any uh, word problem that are based on two digit number. Many students find difficulty in forming these numbers and in many of the examples you get that if this number is added the two digit get uh, number get reversed. So we'll take a uh, few examples on that type of questions also. So we'll take another example in the next video. Hope it will be helpful. Try to solve this type of question, 4 to 5 questions, so you will become more and more confident on this type of questions. Thank you.